King Kong, King Kong, King Kong, Abba, King Kong. Alright, let's talk to him. You made a decision, haven't you? You can tell that just by looking at my face, bro. Man, how long have I known you? Since what? Kindergarten? And you've been making that same stupid face. So come on, tell me what you want to do. I think I think I should go. I think I should declare for the NBA draft because I don't think I can get the the five percent for the G League stuff no more. You might have thought you knew me, bro, but I ain't made a decision yet. So why are you bugging me then? I can't say hey to my best friend in the whole wide world. Is that a crime, bro? Why don't you come back to me when you made a decision? You got a lot of people waiting on you, bro. I don't know. A few moments later. Yeah, why are you going to all these different affiliations, bro? I, I, all I said I was going to Beast of the East, bro. But then you were talking about Nice earlier, man. What's going on? I, uh, it was a slip of the mind. I like uh, slip of the tongue. I didn't mean to say Nice. I meant to say uh, East. But but you know, like Tassino is not on on Nets. You know what I'm saying? So like, how are you to know, know. that they're gonna be the team to win win events? I got a feeling. I not I can't get this, skip this cussing, huh? What cussing? The beginning cussing after you make a bill? Um, I don't know. Uh, hell no. I'm trying to figure out if I should go to D League, I mean G League, or go uh to the draft. Wait, wait, so wait, can you go to college then G League? Yeah. Can you, do you get the G League boost too? I don't know. Ooh. If you get that G League boost, I say go to G League. Yeah, but I don't think I'm gonna get it, bro. <laughs> I think they're trying to sell me, bro. Hey, card this build. What? The build I made, I fuck with it. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna just go to the G League, bro, because yeah, take your ass to the G League. But like, I wanna go in the city now. Like, you in the city or you are you are you doing the story? I'm doing the story. Right, like you said, you ready to become an old? How you gonna say fuck me? You was on the game for I don't know how long, though. No. All right, man. Bye. Ain't you man. a big? Yeah. So, what we gonna do? What you mean, nigga? I'm a shooting big. What you talking about? Nigga, so am I. What that mean? Nigga, post scoring, nigga. Do you post scoring, nigga? So you want to go to the you want to go to the to the park with two shooting bigs and go while crazy? I post, while, while I post up, how tall is your big? Six nine. Oh, so I'm gonna be going against the, the bigs anyway. I'm 6'11. That's what I'm saying. I'm kicking their ass, bro. <laughs> you toxic, nigga. I'm mean, gonna VC. Hell no. I'm doing I'm doing my career first. I'm gonna learn how to use my build. No. Bye, bro. <laughs> Alright, bro. Up, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. Man, let's go, chat. I guess we're going to the G League, bro. You made a decision, haven't you? You can tell that just by looking at my face, bro. Man, how long have I known you? Since what? Kindergarten? And you've been making that same stupid face. So come on. Tell me what you want to do. Man, y'all want me to go to the G League, bro? Uh... Hey, I want to go to the G. The G! Hey, wait, you excited? Yeah, man. Look, whatever you want to choose, I'm behind you 100%. Man, you look, I'm, I thought you was going to be upset that I don't want to declare for the draft right now. Nah, man, you got to take whatever path is right for you. And I'm always gonna support you. That'll never change. Come on, man. It's way beyond basketball. You getting misty eye, bro? Man, shut up, bro. Hey, look, I love you, Rick. Yeah, yeah. You say so. Hey, get out of here. I'm gonna make some calls, set some things up, and when you come back, we'll talk next steps. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Ah, <sighs> G League, it is, man. Yo, what's up? How you feeling, bro? You ready to start living that professional life? Hey, you think my mama still bring us dinner every now and then? We're about to start living our dreams 
And you still think about your mom's Have cooking? Have you tasted what you be cooking in here? Yo, she making pork chops tonight. You know you love her pork chops. Honestly, no offense, but you need to get your head in the game. You need to start thinking about juggling practice and meetings, interviews. Interviews? What do you mean interviews? I'm here to play ball. That other stuff, that's going to have to work itself out. Okay, but it won't just work itself out. Look, man, you and I both know you're not going to play on Ignite forever, which means you only got a little window to soak up all you can. So the both only on G League team you can yeah, play on yeah, is Ignite. Right. All right? Okay. I'm going to do whatever I got to do to be the best player that I can be, but I just need you to tell me what to do off the court, and I'm going to do it. Like we always did. Okay. What's different? It's not going to work like that because we're not in high school no more, man. This is the start of, like, real life. Look, it's time that both of us figure it out what we really want to do. All right, that's going to come with some life decisions. All right, look, I can give you advice, but when it comes to making those decisions about who you want to be and who you don't want to be, only you can make that choice. Yeah. He said, check out your bill. Look, check in with your media center more often, too. I mean, you want to talk about making decisions, that thing's going to be a lifesaver. I loaded up all the things with your daily tasks so you can figure out what you need to be doing. Come on, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I need you for, baby. I appreciate you. I'm just doing my job, man. Talking about my cooking. All right, let's get it. Welcome, basketball fans. We've got some G League action Ignite. In this game, we'll see the I'm Blake Suniga. Alongside me today are Brian and AI. Man, it's good to be with you guys. Oh, oh yeah. Awesome to be here, Blake. Really so hold on, Irwin's in here? In. I'm expecting both teams to really bring it tonight. Yeah, and these guys know how important it is to play their best in these games, knowing they could be just oh, hold on. away from making that. By the way, did anybody up. notice this this damn arena? And this should be a good one, guys. Buckle up your seatbelts. Over to the wing. High post Mercer. MP up top. Clock at six. To the inside. Good for the so, basket. Starting off one for one. This arena is nice. And you look at how the G League is attracting top. Man, why is he the ball handler, bro? Fuck is up with all these point forwards, bro. Good in that we'll probably see fewer one and duns. University just blew right by me. On players who might be there for a while, and that can help continuity, which is a big so. plus. Brings it from beyond the arc. I love this about MP. He can stretch you out and really extend that defense. Pause, bro. You really like MP? He can stretch you out. What? Oh, shit. Here's Newton. Go. Stop playing with him, yo. Big MP. Defense team ignite outside Chris shot clock at six pass to Newton releases the shots good on the assist bro First he literally just that right in front of me half in. MP on the wing Newton covering down low why don't you stay, bro? Here's Chris. Rejected by MP. Textbook defense from MP. That's just gotta pump him up whenever he's able to come up with blocks. And MP and an immediate. Bro, I need a three, bro. Like, come on. And with a younger team like this, talent wins out. Not a surprise to see MP starting. He'll just need to perform so his spot is justified. And it gets the bucket. I mean, it's pretty simple at this point. They cannot afford to give him that kind of look. Well, it came off a good screen, but still, as a defender, you have to fight over the top of it. You need some help as well. A costly foul so. there. He'll shoot three free throws. And the speed of the professional game. Something incoming players mm -hmm. always talk about. Make all your free throws, baby. Fast as the NBA, but it's a world of from college. 
Let's go. I'm getting used to for many first year G Leaguers. Man, the Oklahoma City Blue franchise. All three. Let's go. Around, and they've won a couple different jerseys before landing in OKC. Yeah, you see that a lot in the G League. This team has history all the way back to 2001. But ever since 2014, they've been. This dude Newton is killing me. And here we are kicking off the G League season. A lot of games to be played. Well, the traditional G League schedule. 50 games not as many as the nba but it's still a grind for many of these players it'll be more games let's go ever played before i try to get that so double take exciting. the start of the g league season always fun to see new faces and talent coming into the g and while that's true for all teams in the g league it's a special oh man not like this like team ignite we could be seeing the start of not only a future nba player but a future franchise cornerstone tonight now here's mp He's got eight. Here's AI. Oh, he's nuts. Block this shit. Chris. Yes, and a nice assist from Newton. Textbook. Nice pass. Bro. Nice catch. Nice shot. Pass to Palmer. Bayless. MP. Newton covering. And here's MP from the arc. Team Ignite rebound. But they get it back. It's stolen by Bennett. Fuck. And look at this Team Ignite roster. It is special. A ton of talent. They're starting to pull away, bro. They'll need to fuse it all together over the course of the season. But this is one of the most talented Team Ignite rosters we've seen. A lot can happen over the course of the year. Now here's MP. Drills Let's in go. from outside. You have to admire how assertive MP is. Ready to shoot as soon as he gets it. So I gotta shoot it as soon as I get it. Bro, they is cooking me, bro. Again, the blue good for Sheesh. Boy, I could just imagine what the NBA gonna be like, bro. AI with it. MP outside. And another three. Sheesh, bro. Uh, you said hit. Um, can I hit up the store? I don't know, bro. I ain't buy VC or nothing. We've got a nine second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Higgins, right side, inside. The jump hook, and it's MP with the rebound. Pass to Bayless. MP outside from deep. And he hits again from deep. That was from the parking lot. MP really showing off the range on that one. Here's Newton from the arc. Not gonna go that time. And so Let's go. Uh, Jerome, yes, I'm on next gym, bro. Quarter. Team Ignite ahead. They're up by three. And we'll bring you the start of quarter two when we return. All right, let's go. Yeah, hey, I right, definitely play quarter smarter. Quarter Way quarter smarter, bro. On MP so far. Well, I love everything he's doing on the offensive end. He's getting the better of the defense and finding plenty of early buckets. Well, he's off to a great start offensively, I agree. But the G League is home to some excellent defenders. We'll see if he has what it takes to keep it up after they've had a chance. I thought he was too big to play me. And the big names for Team Ignite are part of the one-year program. They get compensated well as they prepare for the NBA draft. The team serves as a professional training center for elite talent. Just another fantastic path to the NBA. Rejected mm. by Newton. MP, Newton covering. Come on, I need you to roll, bro. I need you to roll, bro. MP outside. Pass to Lawson. <laughs> Let's get right. Damn, Lawson. I'm in, I'm, I'm in the crowd. Higgins outside. Newton with the screen. Now here's Teague. Newton shoots over Diaz. This motherfucker passed out a shot. It's not going to go for him. So it's Team Ignite now. They haven't allowed any points in the second quarter. Let's go. And the basket is good. There's so much this young man can do. MP showing the versatility with the dribble draft. Some tough offensive sets, and they really want to turn it around. They got a lot in. Bro, he's just running right through me, bro. Aggressive Damn. and fantastic finish. I gotta put that perimeter defense up. Slam, I think. What 
I'm not sure. Just a message. Get out of my way? Yeah, maybe that. How about the message is, I'm one of the best dunkers around, and I'm showing you why. Because that's how you send oh, shit. hands and down. Now, here's Collins. No scoring yet from him, but that's fuck, likely fuck, to fuck, change. Fuck, 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 fuck. Looking back on the Blues' previous seasons, they've had some truly outstanding winning Come rates. on. I know we got I know we got And well above 600 when it comes to winning percentage. That kind of dominance. Someone just told me he was about to do that, bro. Remarkable. He presents a defender with a serious challenge. Always. Screen by Lawson. To the paint. And so he drops okay. the foul on the shot, a trip to the line to shoot two. How's the badge progress? Uh, it's pretty good. Yeah, the G League hit hard. I think I'm coming out, yeah. And so it's a close game. Hey, Luan, you in? Nice. All right, we up by two. Okay. They lead by a bucket. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on. Right, but can you look at the build I just sent you on Discord? And with the first half behind us, All right. what have you seen from MP so far in this one? Well, he couldn't have done any better at the offensive end, taking good shots, shooting a high percentage. It's been a sharp game for him. And it's not all finesse. He's got the physical tools you want in a power. Uh, look like that Bill Coolin, bro. Lot to like about him. AI is screen. Now here's MP. Defense is right there. Pass to AI. Bennett with Jesus. The Higgins with it. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Outside Newton. And he misses the go-ahead basket. Team Ignite with the lead. Here's MP for three. Newton with the rebound. <sighs> it's Chris on the wing. Covered by AI. Pass to Newton. Took the contact and tried to throw it down over the top. He tried to he tried to kill Mercer. I cannot lie, bro. G League so exciting to follow is that it's really an ever changing league. Yeah, from the teams to the players to the rules, it's always evolving. Two way scrum machine, I could dribble and shoot. Nice. Anyone's game. And for many of these players, this is the new and busting ass, bro. Newton is busting ass. You hear me? Job, as you said, Brian. You get good in a hurry. There will be a lot to learn from any first time G Leaguers. It's a, a bit of a, a trial by fire. Kicks it out to MP. Pass to Mercer. Thank God, bro. Well, I finally got Mercer in the game. Using the pick and roll to create for another team. Now here's Higgins. He's guarded by Palmer for the lead, and that's good. Who the fuck left him open, bro? Ball distribution has been outstanding. Yeah, Tim. It's just the dumbest shit I've ever seen, bro. Assist, do not lie. And they keep piling up. To the middle. Out to Palmer. MP outside. That's in there. Palmer with the assist. Shit, bro. He's been one of their more reliable options today. His shooting has led him to this lead. Here's Higgins. He's guarded by Palmer. Here's Bennett. And the blue getting another bucket right there. They are running the best plays in the business, bro. One item that stood out is their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking, and more importantly, it's tough to defend. Pass to MP for three. Oh. That shot is good. He is hey, chat. I think I know what to do now. Look here at the former college standout MP decided to make the move to the G League for this year. And for his development, it makes sense. Had a good run in college and the tournament. So I'm interested to see how so. he fares in the G League. Newton with it. MP's there. Can't get it to go. Shooting 47% on 7 for 15 attempts. Here's Palmer, guarded closely. MP outside. Mercer with the screen to the paint. Nice Let's go. Led him to the rack. Let's go. I got to start running, please, chat. Uh, uh, Slim Dusty was good. 
So the six five guards still get all dribbling moves or six four and under. Come on, man. You seen what Mike Wayne tweeted, Daquan? You know what it is. Six four, bro. Get right, come on. Let's go. Three point shot all game long, and he has not let him down. Well, his shooting got them in a position to win this game now, and with the clock winding down and the score where it is, his green light is just going to stay on. And yeah, that might need a couple more from him. Newton covered by MP. Newton misses. And just a tiny lead for them. A chance to make it a little bigger right here, though. Takes the three. That shot missing. Should should drop my takeover on. Now here's Higgins. He's guarded by Palmer. Here's Damn it, bro. He's made five so far, shooting a nifty five for seven. A look at the clock, a little under three and a half minutes gone in the fourth. MP on the wing. Puts up a three. Ooh, no luck on that one. And I wasn't open enough. The lead is two. No good that time. Mercer, nice D there. Davis outside. Pass to MP. 16 feet out. That shot. How am I taking that, bro? Going the other way now. And there's a foul called on MP. Yeah, bro, I had to call it, bro. First foul of the game. Damn it. So does this help with rep two or just overall? Just uh, overall, you do not get any uh, XP from my career. Go. Yes, sir. Focus from the big man. Yes, sir. Like AI absorbs whatever the D throws at him and still converts. Here's Newton. Bro, you knew the screen was coming, bro. That was slick. The D had no chance. None. Yeah, he was one step ahead all the way. And here's MP from the arc. Here's Mercer. Let's go. In tie game, that is a huge basket right there. Check out Mercer just pushing through the contact and using his size to get his shot. Come on, come on, yo. I know we can get a stop here, but if they give, I ain't gonna lie. If they give Newman a ball, bro. I mean Newton. It's about to be just GGs, bro. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, let's go. He better not. Whew. Let's go. 
Let's go, bro. Let's go, chat. Turn us up, chat. You know what I'm saying? Team Ignite with the dub. You feel me? Ooh, I cannot lie. That one right there was scary. Oh, man. Jeez, bro. Yo, 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 you look tired. Bro, yeah, the schedule ain't no joke, man. Yeah, well, it's working. Me opening a lot of eyes, bro. I reached out to a couple of reporters and lifestyle reporter and a beat reporter are willing to sit down Hold with on, you. when am I going to have time for all that? Ah, uh, you don't, really. But, I mean, you can make time. I mean, for one of them, at least. Yeah, all right, look, just give me the guy number. I'll make the I call. I never said they were guys. I mean, that's a really old school way of thinking. I mean, yeah, in this case, they are both guys. But, all right, anyway, nah, you go meet them somewhere in the city. But let me know if this sounds like something you'd be interested in. I'll just show you where they're going to be at on the map. Yeah, all right, cool, Rick. Oh, one last thing. I've been doing research on both these reporters all day, so... Let me know if you need help making a decision. Hey, what do you know about that lifestyle reporter? Andrew Torres. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Writes for Teed Up. He did that piece about uh, Jason Tatum's shoe collection. Oh, I remember that, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, realistically, nowhere near the same number of readers as John, but he'll introduce the world to who you are off the court. Now, I mean, this is exactly the kind of thing that can help us with up your profile with music and fashion. Everything that we've talked about over the last couple of years. Now, he's going to be working at the cafe if you're interested. He said, feel free to stop by. He'd be happy to chat. Sound good. Let's just, let's just think about it. Okay, so who's this beat reporter? Uh, John Luck. He's a really great writer. Well, I'm not going to lie. He's actually pretty basic. But there's a ton of people who read him, including some in the NBA. Now, he'd be great to establish such a serious, trustworthy, and level-headed. Okay. But he's not going to let you express your individuality much. <laughs> yeah, there's a trade-off. Definitely good if you want to go for that more corporate vibe. Okay, look, I hear you. Let me just, let me think about this one. Yeah, I think, I, I think I'm good. I appreciate it. I'm going to just, I'm going to think it through. Yeah, man, don't mention it. That's what I'm here for. All right. No. Mr. Torres? MP, right? Ricky's yeah. Bro? How you doing? Yeah, yeah. Good, man. Thanks for, uh, thanks for joining me. Uh, I got this deadline. I'm already past due, but I'm not going to send you back to Ricky. Tell him I didn't even have time to ask you a few questions. So uh, your boy's got some hustle, by the way. Seems like a good guy to have in your corner. Oh, look, no doubt, man. I don't know where I'd be without him helping me with all this stuff. It just allows me to focus on the court, you know, nothing yeah. but ball. Yeah, I mean, you certainly look like you're focusing on the court out there. But, you know, on the on-court stuff, I mean, I feel like everybody can see that. You know what I mean? What I'm more interested in is what makes you tick, yeah. all right? So a year from now, let's say, right, you're stepping off the bus at an NBA arena. What's going through your mind? You know, it's about making sure I got that fit correct. Look, all eyes go be on me. I got to look good, man. So no thoughts about the game itself? Yeah, yeah. You know, those are going to always be there. But for my first game, first outfit got to be popping. You get one chance to make a first impression. You know that. Mm. You sound like the kind of guy that might start their own fashion line after basketball is over. Why wait? I like the confidence. <laughs> okay, well, this has been eye-opening, and uh, I'm sure my readers will agree. Yeah, you're, you're welcome, man. And do, do I owe you anything for the food or, or how does First this work? First interview? Yeah, I have a feeling it won't be your last. Uh, no, MP, you're good, man. Don't worry about it. Hey, I appreciate this so much, Andrew. Thank you. Yeah, you got it. I'll see you around? Yeah, yeah. Take care, man. Yeah. What, man? Hey, Chad. I'm beat the fuck out of these tell, boys. Tell, tell Ronchi how this motherfucking G League and Kyle is going to beat the Goofy off this nigga. This nigga right. I don't like my boss going. <laughs> right. What is Paul score? A demon, you hear me? Yeah, okay. You know what they do to demons, right, motherfucker? Your ass gonna get exercised. Man, fuck out of there, dude. He gonna be exercising your ass out there on that court. Nigga, that nigga brought you here. Another ah! presentation of Jesus. <laughs> right, I'm still you gonna, you gonna be upset when I, when I just breathe through this shit. Okay. I'm just saying, they gonna beat the fuck out you. Somebody said VC working, I think. Oh, come on, man. Okay, Ronchi, you got some time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
throughout the season. Absolutely. I mean, you have call-ups, you have two-way players, you have new signings, so the lineups and strategies are constantly changing. It's quite a test for coaches and players. So, yeah. Well, he's not I, miss, I can meet Chris Berkley. He don't want to go there yet. But he has that tremendous athletic Get your ass beat. Now here's Maxwell. Yeah, you better ask Ricky about that. Whipped. Mm -hmm. It's his first trip to the line. <laughs> the first one falls. Oh, that's nice. So he gets them both. Here's AI. And one advantage the G League has, you learn to play in NBA level offenses. Many teams run the same offense, the same system with their affiliates. So you get a chance to see the timing and movement of what NBA teams do, and it helps make that transition if you're lucky enough to get a spot in the NBA a little easier. Pass to Maxwell. Let's it go for 14, and it's MP with the rebound. Here in the first with a little over a minute played so far. And stolen by Dampier. Everybody wants to talk about the bills they done made. Well, Tell to get out there. Now Petrovic. What you talking about? Clock at six. Oh, broke as fuck, Hayes. nigga. <laughs> He always knows where his teammate's going to be, and he'll have Such that ball mouth. there waiting for him. Tell what you got all your fucking animation. I ain't, can't afford it. Outside, to the inside. AI. And no good. Excellent D there from Maxwell. To the middle. Here's Dan Pierce. I just got dunked on. I'm about to quit. I tell you, he is tough to stop. Trying to quit, bro. Yeah, he can just get up a few yeah. notches higher than everyone else. You just can't let him get to um, the play like yeah, the, the whole tournament. It's no, so why? Look, I only, I only played one. Why the fuck is this saying I'm declaring my thing for the NBA draft? I want to join the D League. I, I think I need to be think well more time. Or do I just go to Korea and click the next game? Right? Y'all bills valid. Okay, yeah, hold you on. Go to, Let me get right. Yeah, you go to, you go to the TV, to my hub, bro. Got you. All right. All right. Yeah, what you about to, this boy? Finna, this boy finna declare. Stacks up against near NBA talent. You're back. One of the most valuable right. things to be learned in these G League games in front offices. Well, this is why you run plays through MP, showing great command of the offense. Dudes is already bad glitching out here in these Just streets. Two and a half minutes played here what? in the first quarter. Yeah, bro. You're getting to it early, huh? These people is crazy, bro. Tight defense on him. I can't blame him. Nigga don't want. Nigga don't want to. Nigga never want a badge, man. Matched only by his energy, guys. He's usually in the middle of everything for them. And here's MP from the arc. And it's Wisconsin. Bro. Maxwell outside. Left side Haynes. Foster. Are these dudes really good, or am I just ass? Terrific assist and a nice finish. Just a solid play all around. Everything's going according to good ass, like, bro. Good ass question, gang. That's a good ass question. <laughs> I don't know my life, like, bro. My bad, gang. I don't. You right. Right as hell. No cap. I'm telling you, bro. This G League shit. It's menacing, bro. I just spent 100k on my on my bill. Ain't go nowhere. And ain't go nowhere. Uh, what you mean? I, I went. I, I did this shit evenly. Ain't go nowhere. <laughs> you keep saying that shit like it's like it's just gonna become true, nigga. No. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> big, big, big 67. Fuck out of here. But they, they got a perk system in here. Yeah, bro. That's dope. <laughs> Yeah, that's what Chris Brickley is all about. You know what I'm saying? You go to get your ass beat okay. if you want. And I'm good. I'm I'm going away from that, bro. <laughs> okay, I wonder if any uh animations are locked. Oh yeah. Uh, sir. Oh, and one lay. Mercer can't dunk, but he can lay. Let's go. Lay. 
What would you say? <laughs> no. And Team Ignite making a change here. His first trip to the free throw line. Come on, man. What, oh, what does dunk style mean? And you know the herd Let's go. Just joined the G this, League. Oh, shit, I can't, I can't do no shit anywhere. They've had a little bit of a bumpy start. Man, you can, now, but. <laughs> now they all require yeah, a driver dunk. Exactly. <laughs> Nigga, like I got a 25 driver dunk. I know, nigga. <laughs> you said, Party said, this Christian Hart, I just beat that Christian. What <laughs> You said that Chris Brickley should Hart? Who said they beat it? <laughs> Show me your fucking <laughs> perks. Show me your fucking perks. Show me your fucking perks, Cole. Show me your fucking perks, dude. I was raised in Walnut Creek. That's my stomping grounds. And I got the utmost pride in my city. Bro, when the yo? Creek is a great place to spend your time, whether you're an NBA prospect no. <laughs> or. Well, yo, Cole, swear to God that you that you did it. I'll do that shit right now. Every one of these guys on the herd would love to. I'm a witness. He did. Bet. I'm on it. He about to go. I think the fucking shit beat out of him, Jack. <laughs> So if I lose, do I never get to come back? <laughs> Yo, Sailor, thank you for the five gifted sub. Appreciate you. Thank you. 2K is not playable at all. Vic, why you say that? Thank you for the gifted, the nice gifted. Somebody say perks. Rayon, get your, get your ass out of here. <laughs> Look all these brown shirts. You got some drip? Yeah, bro. All this pre-order vibes. Because I, pre I can't afford shit. <laughs> <laughs> bro, the pre-order, yo, I ain't gonna lie. The pre-order shit's ass. All right, Chris Brickley. You know what I'm saying? I want that mama mentality badge. Let's get it. You said I'm about to get my ass beat? But you about to get the fuck beat out of you. Let's get it, man. Start some drills. Shot that shit. And something that all the young Let me see Kenny. On the fly, just how difficult Yo, Kenny, I'm gonna need a better pitcher than that game. It's difficult for any of us to manage our time, let alone if you're a basketball star trying to make the NBA. So these young men have been trying to find a balance as the season wears on. Don't do that. Now here's Maxwell. Oh my god, he dunked on me. Right, showcase your, your skills in a 3 3 game to 21. Yeah, hey, let's get it, man. Oh, give me that ball. Give me that ball. Oh, so now, baby ass nigga. Baby ass nigga. Baby. Ooh. Baby ass nigga. What are you talking about, nigga? Are you saying this is hard, nigga? Huh? Nope. 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 We on that. We on that. We on that. We on that. Hell no. You crazy? Come on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, boy, I got a baby. Give me that ball. Give me that ball. <laughs> I got a baby, nigga. I got a baby, nigga. And a little background on MP here for Team Ignite. He actually has a steady following from the internet. He ran a channel where he'd upload videos. Let's go. Hell no. Nah. You crazy. First time we saw Team Ignite. There has been some definite improvement. No, 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 Kelly, don't shoot that shit. Coming more and more comfortable with the speed. The more they play. Who saw the early? Got it though. I didn't. I, <laughs> bro, why do I got the backpack and the skateboard on my back while I'm hooping with these niggas? That's what I got. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? No, don't do that. Don't do that. Bad decision. Bad decision, nigga. Defense crazy. Hell no. Nah. Oh, how he get that board? Bro, I might have started going up under the rim or something. He's more than just a name. Here's Foster. And almost four minutes gone in the second quarter of play. Just 21. Etrovich with it. He's against Mercer. He kind of short armed that one after doing a nice job to get open. Disappointing. And what a trial run for Team Ignite last year, nabbing Jalen Green, Jonathan Kaminga, and Dacian Nix. Absolutely rocking college scouting. And those guys, they, they proved 
You can be a top pick and take that route. They talk about how much they enjoy sure. their experience with Team Ignite, and I think we're going to see more of this in the future. And that is how you execute pick and rolls. Mercer slashing with precision there. Pass to Foster. Maxwell outside. Take it away. Come on, let's go. That one drops for God damn it. I like the way he's taking advantage of what the defense is giving him. He's been a key contributor for them this quarter. MP with it. Bishop defended by Maxwell. MP outside. Mercer with the screen. Shoots over Haynes. Mercer, no good. Bro, what the hell, bro? Here's Foster. From deep three point range. Let's go. Pretty tightly contested game here as we end the first half. Team Ignite ahead, up by two. And we'll see you right after halftime for the beginning of Yo. the third quarter. And of what? Halfway through this one, give me a breakdown of what Did you? you're seeing from MP. He needs to be sharp okay, cool. in terms of the mental aspect of the game. Far too many turnovers I, in the first half. No, nah, I haven't played it. Noticed in all the wrong ways. Perhaps a case of him trying to do too much. We got that as beat. That's what I remember. I like his level of effort. He just needs to slow the game down and cut down on the mistakes. Terrific timing on the rejection. I love when MP goes after shots in the race. That's in there. Palmer with the assist. Well, of course, you might know MP from his days in college, but you also might know him from his video channel. Yes. Oh, you wild, huh? Bit of internet fame. Oh, now you on Twitch, so you good. He would upload. Now here's Maxwell. He's got 10. Here's Petrovic. Block, boy. Yo, I like the blocks in this gym, bro. He coming out of nowhere on niggas. Imidos. Petrovich. Defense right on him. Here's Foster. The herd again can't hit it. And the fandom has followed MP here to the G League. But how'd he get in front of me, bro? Than just an internet presence. And the G League will be his first yeah. real test in that regard. What you mean, like working the post? Yeah, be baby and niggas. Not a hundred percent committed to that goal. You're gonna get exposed really quickly. Now here's Maxwell. Yep. Kick by Dampier. Maxwell drives in. Mercer, nice D there. Team Ignite with the lead. MP outside. And so he drops the foul. Damn, I dropped my hook. Oh. Pushing the action, making well, his my controller. Felt. MP is getting it done at the offense. Oh, yeah. He's gone two for two at the line so far. And that one misses. Oh, shit. And the second free throw, good. And we're about one and a half minutes. Yo, D'Angelo, what's good, bro? Petrovic outside. Teardrop shot. It's rebounded by Team Ignite. Pass to MP. Takes the three. That's in there. Palmer with the assist. He's played an important role in their offense today. Without him, they might not be in front. You're about to play yours. You just don't know uh, what, what position to play with. Whatever you choose, my guy. It's up to you. Huh? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You see them time limits and all that? That's what I, that's what I need and need. And that's it for the third quarter. Both teams scoring well as we head into the fourth. Team Ignite ahead. Up by nine. Mm -hmm. Shit, they told you just fast travel. As
as we head to the fourth. Even though it's, even though it's only fast travel to your crib, but shit, you might be on the other side of the map one day and just need to go ahead and go to the crib real quick. And he's one of them. If he keeps playing like this, it won't be I ain't gonna lie, bro. That kick push it is. That shit pissed me off. This kind of firepower is hard to overlook. Screen by MP. Jacks up a three. Sinks the right. pointer. Well, they certainly haven't hesitated to let it fly from deep here in the second half. And I don't have a problem with that either, Tim. I mean, as long as they're falling, right? I'll be letting them all go fly, Chad. I'm trying to tell you. The lead. To the paint, Brooks. And finished off by Brooks. They'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. Well, the deficit will go away quickly if he does. Easiest play, just dunk it. Yeah, just dunk right. it. Rise above the rim, young fella. And I like the way he capped that drive off, though. The one-handed punch. What's up with you? Why you ball handling? I ain't chasing y'all around. And it's Mercer picking him up. A good board there, but overall, they're getting slightly out-rebounded. And they've just got to find a way to get back into so. the game. That's as good a place as any. Just increase the effort on the boards. He is bombing it today. How many more threes are we going to see from him? Well, we've already seen play. I went to, I went to, uh, to the Bulldogs. The arc, then I got, got that three finishing. The one playmaking, he made that. That's just what I call a captivating Bro. move there. He absolutely incinerated the defense with that one. MP, no good. Well, sometimes you just want to show off your range. We already know how good his range is, so he shouldn't be firing from that deep. It's going oh, first bump still I saw. And one, let's go. Uh, you said 98 Trey, not 98 Rudy, bro. taking care of business in this one. MP was unreal from beyond the arc. His teammates recognized it. They kept feeding him, and he kept delivering. Tonight, a big step forward for MP. He showed the ability to stretch the floor. That's imperative in today's game. And that's gonna do it. Thanks for I went to the one with the three finishing and one playmaking bullfrogs. We'll see you next time. Woo -hoo -hoo, there he is. Yo, you know you killing it out there, bro. Ah oh, man, I'm just trying to finish the season strong, okay? Man, trying, you definitely are. And I ain't the only one noticing. You know, I just got off a very important phone call inviting you to a pickup game with some former NBA stars. Yo, stop playing with me. For real, man. I mean I think this could be a great opportunity to showcase your talent against some real NBA players. I mean, look, I'm just saying, keep this up, and managing all the people trying to get at you is going to be a full-time job. <laughs> yo, pretty soon, people are going to be sending you free stuff just to hope that people will get to see you. <laughs> hey, yo, free stuff, whenever they want to start, bro, I'm ready. You really ready? I'm ready, ready. Now that you mention it, I've been working the phones for the past few days trying to set up this endorsement opportunity. Look, actually... If you're not feeling a pickup game, let me know, and I got somebody you could talk to about a potential deal. Wow. Hey, yo, Rick, did they tell you who was showing up? Man, all I know is that this dude has been around long enough and through enough. Man, it could be anyone from a Hall of Famer to the Phoenix Suns gorilla. <laughs> and actually, that gorilla's pretty good. Look, not without his trampoline. <laughs> Man, anyway. <laughs> Dude and whoever else is gonna be at the old armory this afternoon. And it's gonna be big, man. Okay, cool. Let me let me think about it. Hey, yo, Rick, what's this? What's this endorsement deal, bro? Because look, if you're trying to get me on a billboard, I gotta go get a cut, man. <laughs> All right, gotta slow stay down, pretty. Slow down. I I ain't a wizard. Well, actually, with what I just pulled off, I might be. Okay. Look, you know swags, right? Uh, absolutely. I convinced the owner to drop you some extra bread just for walking around in some shirts, B. <laughs> easy, 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 bro. Oh, you like that? Yes. Well, then you should probably head down there today because when I asked him yesterday, he said no. So <laughs> today he said yeah, so I'd, I'd, get, I'd get cracking on that. Oh, man. Okay, look, let me, let me, let me just think about it. Let me peel it over. <sighs> man, I need, I need, I need this endorsement, Yo, Rick, bro. What's this, what's this endorsement deal, bro? Because look, if you're trying to get me on a, 
man. Good looking out, bro. Always, man. I need VC, bro. I ain't gonna cut. Yeah. I got I gotta go all the way to fuck the swags. <laughs> Why you talk so sad? Bro, it's just so far, bro. <laughs> why don't you why don't you teleport home, Dingo? Bro, it's seven hundred meters from the crib, bro. Oh my god. And, but go ahead and get the I boy got, kick push, nigga. Listen, I got a kick push with this VC. They told us about <laughs> endorsements. I got, to, I got to get every dollar. <laughs> Crack pot out here, bro. I cannot lie. I'm tired of riding around on it with this 2K22 book bag, man. Look like I just came from a goddamn release party. <laughs> Shit, I got two copies in my back pocket. Shit, I got the like, UCLA on. better be good. Yo, yo, all right, all right, please, Carter, please tell me that you don't got them damn pants on, bro. Which one is the dress pants? Yes. Oh. Okay, thank you. I don't got the dress pants on. You valid. Why would I have the dress pants on when I'm wearing a, a 2K20 Kevin Durant shirt and two sleeves? You got, you got both sleeves, bro? <laughs> this is cold outside. All right, bro. <laughs> Nah, bro, I don't want to talk to you, bro. This nigga missed you playing turn out. <laughs> Yo, miss for the chill, guy. Can I'm on break. What I miss? I just made my build. That's. Whoa, are you MP? <laughs> you are. <laughs> I am a huge fan. Oh man, thank you. Look, I, it's nice to meet you. Man. MP in my store. <laughs> when your buddy told me you was coming down, I, I didn't believe it. I mean, we've been open forever. We never had a celeb in here. Hey, yo, Not look, even close. I'm glad I can help. Okay. Anyway, did Ricky fill you in? I give you a shirt. You walk around in the shirt. People see you in the shirt. They want the shirt. They come in. They buy the shirt. And I give you some money. Hey, that sounds, sounds good to me. If we want people to notice you, we should get you in something bold. Yeah, yeah, look, whatever you think is best. Like, I could do both. Awesome. All right, I'll think of something and I'll send it to you. That way you, you don't have to come all the way down here. All right, keep your eyes on the mail. Got you. This is awesome. You're awesome. You're not awesome. You're going to have me wearing some bullshit. I feel like I'm going to be wearing some bullshit, bro. I'm about to run over. Look at these kids. Badass kids. It's your badass self. You need to go somewhere. You need to go home. You talking to yourself? Oh shit, I'm get out of here. These kids are crazy as hell nowadays. How much VC this thing give me, bro? A few moments later. I'm a little upset because I'm trying to figure out where my goddamn check at. I've been wearing this goddamn green t-shirt around the goddamn. Fuck my check at nigga. My check at nigga. My check. Where my check? It's your name Tony Andrew. Fuck is your name again? In my check, bitch. 